We interrupt this segment to bring you a special news bulletin. Choice. The key is choice. You have options. You need not spend your life wallowing in failure, ignorance, grief, poverty, shame, and self-pity. If this is true, then why have so many among us apparently elected to live in that manner? The answer is obvious. Those who live in unhappy failure have never exercised their options for a better way of life because they have never been aware that they had any choices. Those words are from The Choice, a book written by Og Mandino. If you haven't read it, I highly suggest that you do. And if you have read it, read it again. Your entire life is based on the choices that you make. And for every choice that you make, whether it's made consciously or unconsciously, there is always a consequence. In fact, think about this. Where you are at this point in your life is based on the choices that you made at some point in the past. Those choices are the key factors that determine the quality of life that you have right now. Now you can choose to believe that you are helpless and at the mercy of life's unpleasant twists of fate and misfortunes. You could choose to believe that some people are lucky and some are destined to a life of misery and despair. Now, if that's what you believe, then that will be your reality. On the other hand, you can choose to believe that you have a choice in all of your affairs. That you may not be able to control what happens to you, but you can always choose how to think about what happens to you and always choose the state of mind that you need to be in regardless of what's happening around you or to you. Your life isn't predestined for greatness. Your life is not predestined for failure. It's up to you to create a belief system that allows you to see your life from an advantage rather than a disadvantage. Only you can choose to shift your thoughts and words to turn challenging times into opportunities. Trust me when I say that talent and ability are not the only factors that determine a successful and happy life. For your sake, especially during tough times, get into the habit of choosing positive thoughts and, and speaking empowering words. Focus on hope, gratitude, and seeing the good during adverse times. If you do, you will discover a brighter day, regardless of what's happening to you or around you. The choice is yours, my friends. It always has been, and it always will be. And that, that's the word, according to Bob. <laughs>